Under Uganda Skills Development Project, Uganda Technical College Lira received 14 billion shillings. The initiative by Government of Uganda in partnership with the World Bank is to turn the institution into a center of excellence on road construction. We are here, me in particular together with the Permanent Secretary on behalf of the Senior Minister and the entire Ministry to do an on-spot assessment of how far these projects uh, have gone. The infrastructural development includes material testing laboratory, administration block, both girls and boys hostel, staff house and road equipment already delivered to the institution pending commissioning. For UTC Lira, it is uh, road construction. For UTC Elgon, it is something else. For UTC Bushenyi, it is something else. All the five have their specific areas of skilling Uganda in terms of providing specific skills. The deputy principal UTC Lira Helvis Bongo explained that the equipment will also be used to maintain local government roads to generate revenue for its maintenance. In a way that uh, we shall be having trainers but the city will give us the roads to work on. So in the process uh, I think we shall be generating some revenue. Not only the city, but also have local government that have challenges with the reserve equipment. We appreciate. After UTC Lira, Hobua proceeded to check on the delayed works at Lao College. Here, 412 million was given to construct five classrooms and rehabilitation of Cohen dormitory, one of the traditional dormitories with a bed capacity of 250. The Ministry of Education and Sports, under the leadership of the First Lady, has a plan for all the traditional schools in Uganda. We are aware that schools like Lango College, among many others, are now in bad shape. So the moment this plan is funded, we will embark on uh, the long journey of uh, renovating these traditional schools. The head teacher, Lao College Sami Bobokino, said the new curriculum requires a lot of space and when the classrooms are complete will facilitate proper learning. Lao College currently has 1,005 students in both O and A levels. But I'm happy that the ministry has finally remembered us as a traditional school and they are now on the ground. So as you have seen, the minister has been here, the PS has been here, they have seen the, 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 the status of the school, and I believe their coming will not be in vain. So what is your time frame in the contract, although you are supposed to start in... Uh... After engaging the contractor, Obua said most traditional schools are in very bad shape and once required funds are availed, the ministry will vigorously embark on rehabilitating the Ramshackle traditional schools. Eddie Oloa, UBC News.